We brought together some lightning greats from the 2004 Stanley Cup winning team for a Zoom video call to get to know a little bit more about them. And we found out some pretty interesting things. Here's how it all went down. All right, another one for the uh, for the entire team. Who's most likely to win the lottery but lose the winning ticket? Easy one too. Easy. <laughs> really? Yeah. In his in his car, he'll lose it in his car. <laughs> he'll drop it in the bar, you know. That's terrible. I have under a Dunkin' Donuts mug, your cup. What have I lost? Tell me something that I did lose. Okay, my credit card every once in a while because I was the only one to put my credit card down. So I did leave it at, you know, a couple of establishments. I will say that. What else? Didn't you lose a child one time? <laughs> <laughs> just for a brief moment in Disney. Just for oh, a okay. brief moment in Disney. <laughs> I lose a child, yes. You got to explain that one a little bit, Andy. What happened at Disney? Oh, I, was in the, I was in the gift store. I turned around looking at the beer mugs. Boom, kid gone. <laughs> Panic set in. And, you know, she, were out four, out the store. she walked out of the store. She was four years old, but it was very stressful. I, I have nightmares about that. Thanks for bringing it up, Richie. <laughs> you asked. How long did it take to find it? What have you lost? Quite, oh, three minutes, but it felt like three hours. Yeah. Yeah, you know, it was, it was stressful, very stressful. Another one for the uh, for the entire team. Actually, we have three more. All three are for the entire team. So just go beyond you five guys. Who would be most likely to run for mayor of their hometown? Oh my God! That's easy. That's easy. <laughs> Very easy. <laughs> Very easy. <laughs> oh, uh, yes. Got a new name up there. Yeah, Richie. Why would you go with Dinger? Well, oh, he thinks he's the mayor of Edmonton. Dinger would be perfect at that in his hometown. He'd be perfect. A couple of you guys said tails. Why would you? Why did you say Tim Taylor? I mean, tails is very organized. You know, he's got. He's probably he has a briefcase for it already. I'm sure, and it's nice and tight, and the, the car's washed, and the shoes are shine. Everything is. Uh, Stratford oh, this, Stratford that, Stratford, 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 but loves his town, you know. That was, that's what the mayor says. I love this town. That'd be, that'd be tales. <laughs> Who do you think 2004 head coach John Tortorella is most likely to spend his entire quarantine with from the team, the entire team? If he could spend the quarantine with one player from the 2003-04 team, who would it be? His, his son, Marty. <laughs> no, he wouldn't pick me. No, I don't think he'd pick Marty. No, he would pick uh, – hmm. he'd, he'd want somebody mellow that could engage him, like yeah, like a Corey Sarge, I think. Or Mo. Mo or Sarge. Yeah. Probably. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> I have no you idea. Were his boy, Marty. You were his huh? boy. Yeah, you I were his know. boy a little bit. <laughs> you gotta earn that, right? You guys can break down a game together. You would be breaking all oh. oh. clips. Clips. A lot of, a lot of, video. A lot of video. clips. clips. <laughs> That'd be awesome. And That'd then you could bring in Luke. bring in Luke to the equation. Ask Luke what he's looking at. Don't you like me, Luke? <laughs> 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 I think him and Andre would be have a great time in quarantine. <laughs> yeah, they would. I don't um, think all if I don't think if all three of those went into quarantine, all three <laughs> wouldn't come out. <laughs> be a death match. Be a death match. <laughs> we got one last one for you guys. Who's most likely to win American Idol? Mm. That's on easy. Oh, we got three different answers. Yeah. Uh, Andre. Yeah, I go Andre. Yeah. Oh. Why do you say Andre? He sings, plays he's guitar. guitar. He sings. Yeah, I guess he loves it. I forgot about Andre. He only knows three words to every song. He knows three words to every song. That's all you need to know. 
And then he starts speaking French, and yeah, it's three words. I don't know. He he loves the, he loves to perform. You need to perform. You need to command the stage. Yeah, but that's that would be America's Got Talent. He'd be good for America's Got Talent. <laughs> <laughs> the wheelchair dancing. He might win off that one alone. Yes. The polar bear dog would be good too. That one's just waltz. Boiler, boiler has a voice. Oh yeah, Boiler loves to sing. Doesn't he? It's I don't remember that. You know, he used to come in the locker room. Him and Luke would have the songs going. And Boiler would be there singing. And we were never in there, but those two were in there doing it. <laughs> Just the two of them in that room for a half hour alone, listening to. Oh, I remember Luke. You had the stick. You had the mic up, right? <laughs> and Boiler had the guitar. <laughs> <laughs>